complexity team spirit first of the eighth day of the 12th season. It's on overpass. We have got our microphones up and running, ready to get this party started. Just look like we're going to be seeing a little bit of a push-up towards the monster and wait. I do always like this strategy. A heaven smoke from some die young, likely throwing out the Molotov a little later towards the barrels position, chopper lurking towards the toilets. He might pivot towards the connector position and start to pincer in for this monster in short play. Here comes the util, and there goes Config. Guts get the first, and he's managed to get away. Disbalance opening up onto Ovo, though. And oh, they're lining up for some retakes, something. Double HE for the plant. Yeet, this is fun, buy magics. Ooh, ooh, that hurts. Okay, bombs lose, three on three. Still a minute to play. God, I love that. That's so nicely done. I was a bit worried they left config on an island, but it was all for the greater cause and Blame F showing exactly what he can do here. But you still have I Disbalance and Chopper. Bomb planted times yeah, on their side. Two. Kit and Smoke, look at that powerful combination from the last two. That's gonna get really awkward if they can find an Isolate Chopper here on short. Smoke on the bomb or short? I don't know which I prefer, Chad. It's on the bomb, isn't on it? On the bomb, yeah, you wanna draw them out. Short leaves too many options. They can also just spam you through it. Taking their time here, Blame so, to drop Yeah, this. here we go. Ah, and he peeks before it blooms. Blame doesn't have the kit, he'll have to pick that up, does so. This is... Upper through the smoke, he has to hold it. No real time. Disbalance is called the bluff. Coming through the smoke, he's going to be needing to be precise. And it's disbalance. He opens and closes the case and gets away with 7 HP as well. Just to talk a little bit more about why, at least in my preference, is putting on the bomb as opposed to a choke point, is you're gambling when you put it on a choke point. Unless you had info on both. Yeah, Precisely. Sure. So when you're putting it on the bomb, it's guaranteed. And, and it seems a bit ratty. And uh, I used to hate having to play against it because as soon as the bomb gets smoked by the CT and you've forgotten where you planted or the communication's bad and you only have pistols and you're spamming and hoping and uh, it gets all messy. And that's the point. That is the reason you put the smoke on the bomb. I can't criticize too much because blame... He's a bit of a, a big boy. I don't want to get in trouble with him. I don't want to come knocking on me. I reckon I could beat him in an arm wrestle. Oh, yeah? Yeah. One on one, me and Blame. Well, Config actually dealt with Mir as a danger man that I was just pointing out Sneaky. within the in the pregame. It's a bit awkward now, doesn't it? Head armor, too. Yeah, that was so quick. It didn't look like it was yeah. a frag worth. Uh, Worth addressing, but look at how much the damage this has done to Team Spirit. They are the victors of the previous round. Now, oh, okay, that's a good catch. Poison only with the scout wasn't capable of too much. The config certainly is. They might want to continue to maneuver slowly through this one. Blames in a prime position for a headshot here. Oh, nice work from Magix. Needed that. Incredibly valuable. That first kill just slicing the map almost in half. And then, as said, Blame, what more could he do? Tries to re-aggress for that information. Not much more to be found. Now, the four T players, where do they take this? It looks like they're heading right towards B. Now, it is only Rush here. I think Config already left. He took himself towards A, and he's the danger man. Rifle, of course, recovered earlier on with the old snapping turtle, as now newly appointed. But Config has turned around at the right time. Yeah, he'll be there. Well, full rotation as well. They boost him. Three. What's the strat? He's going to he's gonna get whatever he wants. They're already on the site, so the dunk could be promising. Looks a little too deep. Disbalance down to 63. And Oboe's already hitting shots. Config goes a little too aggressive, but maybe the Deagle. Oh, that's oh. fantastic work from Rush. Magix is low as well. He's got no chance, and Rush is triple from the short position. It's just relentless body shots. They were rushing that plant, ran down the clock, and complexity, they will convert. There should be another AK here. Rush doesn't need to take that Mac 10. Oboe will deliver him the other AK-47 on the ground, and that all really comes down to the initial duel. I know that Config didn't get a lot done with the AK, but just the fact that that's in the back of the mind that they have to worry about that and deal with that, they weren't really so concerned about these pistols. Oof. You see Oboe's shot? I didn't see that the first time. Just a little drive-by through the corner of the box. It was Rush that picks up three frags, and yeah, Magic's had multiple targets to deal with, and there is Blame piping them <laughs> up. All right, well, it is uh, middle of the day, so maybe the gamer hours Require oh, is he watching in school? He's in class. Young man. Well, I hope he's enjoying. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I would prioritize an education over entertainment, but maybe it's a free whatever period. floats his boat. Maybe, maybe oh, it's maybe. a free period right uh, now. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, what his, time is it? Uh, is it lunchtime? Study group. Maybe. I don't know. I'm no one to talk. I used to sleep in economics. We don't encourage that behavior. <laughs> Not many people can live the lifestyle you 
accidentally started living. Oh. Nice work. Poison's got himself a double. So only these Glocks. They do manage to grab a single rifle, and that's going to be SDY's treat for the remainder of this round. Unfortunately for them, any sort of fights. Oh, that was doing the free fires last night, oh, by the way, were? on this exact angle. And uh, I learned a lot. I learned a lot. Did you change map? Oh, this, the, it's not like the complete pre fires, so you just oh. have to go through. It's like Inferno, uh, yeah. B site pre fires. Yeah. Then it goes into Dust 2 B site. So I got up to Dust 2, I was like, I, want, I don't like Dust no, 2. So once you get the Dust 2 B site, that's a good one as well. Oh, so is that. Mir, Hold on. He's making it costly. I don't really foresee much on, with an armored 38 I... HP, but one shot headshot is always a one shot headshot. Sound cute for the reposition. But yeah, there's a lot of weird angles that you don't realize that you're exposing yourself to mm. until you have bots blowing your head off as soon. Like that one, that bin blows your head off, and then that's the end of that. It was good really enjoyed it, honestly. And then, I, uh, and after the pre had a great game. I popped off Chadney. Oh yeah, you I did. Oh, game, we had some good games. Didn't I did we? my yeah, CS:GO hub Swamp. warm up, and I, oh, Swamp was fun. Swamp was fun. Swamp's actually Swamp not was bad. Belting. I didn't mind. They did some updates to Anubis and Mutiny overnight when we went to Ooh. bed. So there'll be some updates. Maybe tonight. we dabble in some more Swamp, fun maps. Anubis, put them all in. Honestly, I just want to play Swamp because an SMG is very viable and it's really it, good fun. You were playing Dirty Bomb last night. Yeah, time, I was just you know straight up brainless aping it. But it is two one. We are onto the gun round. So at least for now, we get to see if Spirit can recover after complexity actually put up some really good work here. Yeah, fast four man start at the start. You're going to see your typical utility exchange. Mir pulls the smoke out and drops it on short to extinguish that stop molly thrown out by Blame. It wasn't Blame, that's a lie. He's still got his. One of the two descending through the lowest. Disbalance is taking a lot of space here. Yeah, this is good stuff. He used to be pushed all the way up and they won't hear it. Notice how far he was to that left hand wall. Never mind. Uh, Blame wants to take Mir out of the equation straight away. And I just bounce by not converting that kill. It doesn't even matter how much space he's taken now because Poison's called it. The rotation can come in to help him. You can see it already. Blame's already on the site. Convig, he's here as well. The Bash brother, Danes, they're here to make sure Poison is safe. Yeah, the flash is to ensure a safe passage back to the site. And now, unfortunately, this is the less fun part of the T side. You can see an early advantage, and now you will be walking into... Uh, I mean, all of them are choke points. Admittedly, A, certainly more viable in that sense, but walking down that monster tunnel into a two-stack... CT, M4, and AK potent mix is going to hurt. Another smoke, deep. It's nice. The deeper you get it, the better, the harder for the T's to make their way on through. 30 seconds is what this will leave them with. Obo has a smoke as well. Oh my goodness, they have to walk through this. Rush knows he's ahead of the flash and he's going to get them both. Oh. SDY does eventually connect. And disbalance into the site. There's a chance here. It's getting minimal now. SDY with 30 seconds might try and rush it through the toilets. There's something Ooh, he can do. Not. Maybe he'll save. If he can... He shouldn't... Oof. Options limited, but he's still going for it. 14 seconds. What's the game plan? They're all on the site. 10 seconds now. Some die young. Nah, kill them after time. If Whatever they do, they should kill him after time. Don't fight him now. Wait! Oh. Okay, they can they can be so much more punishing. Uh, look, I'm, I'm not being hypercritical. I no, just no, want no. to point out something for everybody at home. In that situation, because he's looking to die, right? I know that his name is Sun Dai Young, but he's actually in that situation looking to die because if he dies after the time, he loses everything. He doesn't get the loss bonus. So I'm complexity in that situation, and I'm thinking he's coming in, and I can tuck into graffiti. I can tuck into what CT. I could have gone even deeper into that little water pit and there behind yeah. the site. Let him, let him hang himself, and then take him out of the equation. But maybe they thought, well, he might get away if we don't peek. We want to get rid of the gun. We want to take that out. So there's always lots of types of thinking, and in these split seconds, which is what it was, just get the frag, I guess. So with the pistols back out, this can be another one of those. Uh, those fun rounds for everybody playing at home. Or mainly us. Watch Swamp, you. so. <laughs> yes, yeah, there, there, was, there was frogs and alligators. Um, mosquitoes I didn't enjoy as like an ambient sound. They're never fun, the mosquitoes, in real life or, or in video games either. But um, with the pre-fires that Alex was talking about, mm. uh, if, if you want to do map-specific ones, Lauren. Mm. Um, you have I'll, to load up ESCA. Yeah, I'll get you, I'll get uh, you the ESCA. I'll get you the insider. <sighs> I'll sort you out. I'll, okay. get, I'll get you sorted. I really, look. ESCA is great. I'm just really lazy. I don't want okay. to reload All stuff. Right. I don't well, want to restart. We have options for you too. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'll just team you at her PC and do it for her. <laughs> Thanks, like, that's Alex. honestly the only way. <laughs> I tried to get to install the CSGO Hub web website, uh, yeah. the workshop map, and it got to the point where I was like, you know, just CSGO Hub, okay. just okay, CSGO Hub. And she's thing. like, yeah, but like, could you like link it? I'm like, 
Okay, just, okay. Here's the, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing, right? Okay. Back in back in my day. Here we go. You know, I I was never the person to do the CB finding the game. Oh. Hello. This balance, are you, are, you, are you on one today? Are we, are we getting some some juice here? We've got 25 seconds. Not really. Oh, shot, that's about it. Hold on, hold on. Maybe he's going to fence it. Nah. He's getting the nah. bomb. Okay. Oh, with 18 step. seconds. Okay, here we go. Here, gonna here we go. go. Show me the boom. body. Uh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so back to my point. Yes. I'm really lazy. Okay. And I was spoon-fed the IPs, the teams. You know the, the, the players? Fit. The players in your team where, like, you were the one getting the match. You were the one pasting the IP and TS. Yeah. You were the one that made sure people were there on time. You were the one that made sure you'd send the WhatsApps or the, I'm the messages. I'm pretty sure like, I never knew how hey, a bracket Match at worked. eight, by the way. Match at eight. And then you're like, what do we do? Yeah, you play the losers of this All one. All of my teammates ever, basically. Those ones. Yep. That's Lauren. Okay. Oh, great. All right, well. So I'm gonna I was good at the other to. games, yeah, she could shoot so them. I could get away with it. Now, not very good. Can't get away with it. Can't, can't ego people anymore because I'm hot garbage. <laughs> Just bang them out. Okay. Nice. Good try. Good frags. Not going to translate into anything particularly quantifiable. I assume SDY's got a rifle somewhere. Good damage, I suppose, if we want to look nice. towards uh, the, the, the flow-on effects here. But I'm trying to stay a little bit smaller picture. I go to big picture. I'm looking at the forest, not the trees. Oh, I see what you did there. I hear you also listened to the lyrics of uh, the song we listened to this morning. Oh, which song was that? Uh, Bring Me the Horizon. Oh, yeah. Is that in that song? Yeah. Oh, maybe oh. it's... Uh, you can't see the forest for the trees. It's like an expression, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. yeah it's yeah, like yeah. when you're looking too wired. Well, I'm going to narrow my vision to round number six right now, everybody <laughs> is. Folks and flashes will be coming on out. Deep one towards toilets for that of Team Spirit, but they're looking to do the four-man boost, oh. but uh, they're doing it late. So normally we see this at the very start of the round. And Nobody's there. Oh, the, yeah, okay. So they will get Idris Balance up top. I don't know how long they want to hold this for. And the reason I say that, if Hobo does the jump boost, that is one option. There's been no sound, no nades, nothing thrown. And normally in this case, when you don't get pushed around the map too much, you start to get a little bit quizzical. And you can see they've already fallen off the stack. Do you see, like... I mean, I've just been watching my mini-map while they were doing that. Config and Blame pushed all the way into Underpass, saw nothing. They had Poison watching Party. They're now all falling into passive lines with Blame just jump-spotting long and smoke towards Monster Tunnel thrown out now. Yes, I think they're assuming a, a B execute to come on through off of that. But it's just a delayed default. Well, not really a default, but a delayed spread for territory control from Spirit. It does look like it'll still be a B finish. Yeah. It, uh, the intention is still very much true to course. Poison's keeping everything else safe. He's got the support of Blame F if he needs it. That's quite Config's watching the reassuring. Booze. Yeah, Config's been on this for a very long time, so this is going to be a horrible surprise for Mir. <laughs> Nicely done by Config. That's lovely. Whether or not he just knows it's an intention that Spirit like to do or simply just part of his checklist, it works beautifully. That's the advantage you need, and now the hit looks a little less than ideal. One flash, one smoke, and another one dead. Chopper's down, make it some die young. It's all down to two. Wow, they definitely did their homework. Like, you could, I mean, I may be making more of an assumption that you were trying to avoid, but it felt like Complexity genuinely had a read on Spirit's B sure. hits there. Like, you know Blame likes to do his research. Yeah. We've heard it time and time again. And I, I, it felt like that was a perfect read into an execution of the anti-strat. Config watching the boost, they know they like to do that. They cleared con connector early, but then of course Spirit waved the big flag saying, uh, we're in connector and confirmed their, f their thoughts, their quandaries uh, with that Molotov and bullets thrown out. So this is what Config was waiting for. They try and clear the barrels position. That's so rough. And then by that point, look at the flash, by the way. Blame's flashing them as they push through that short smoke. It's all coordinated and it is a very nice start to Complexity's game. Now, with 3.5 for the three of them, it will be armor and something less ideal. No AK-47s if they want that full armor. Okay, Galils are coming out. So that's not too bad, and that's only been uh, made, well, I want to say recently. It's not too recent anymore, but the price change for the Famous and the Glil. Can we not say that's recently? God, time flies. Yeah, doesn't, doesn't it? it? When was that? That's going to make me feel uh, real. Oh, don't look it up. I swear that's a recent change, <laughs> Lauren. Check. It's it's Galil. definitely over six months ago. Oh. I think it was end of last year when the changes oh. came in for the Org and the Krieg. Galil and Famous price. Here it is. November. There you go. Well, it's like almost 2019. Been a year. It's almost been a year. That's a yikes for me, dog. It's almost been a year. Oh. That's a recent chain. No. no. I'm old. I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. That time's weird. Well, this is what happens when you live in the present, Lauren. You know, time just accelerates, but you live in the present. And you just feel less bad about yourself. We're going to get a, a time machine and we'll go back and we'll see what it was like. Yeah, imagine yeah. being spending... So 
being so preoccupied with concerned about the past and the future that you don't let yourself live the day to day in the present. I have this thing where I like to know what's coming because uh, ambiguity drives anxiety. Mm. Uh, so I, I kind of want to know what's on the horizon a little bit more. And that's why I'm like a planner. Mm. Uh, I always like to know the dates and what's coming up next. Yeah, Chad is a planner. Mm. Yeah. He's, he's got a grip on things. But I, I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to find this balance, right? You, Alex is... Ooh, lemon uh, water. Like Alex and I are trying to... Well, I don't know if he's trying to, no, but it's he, true. he is balancing me out right me now. Me and Chad are both very different ends of a spectrum, right? Okay. Like the spectrum that is kind of organizational. But then, you know, the, the, on the other side, I'm much more capable of living in the present. Uh, we have received an update. I guess we can stop our little podcast. Uh, it sounds like... I always like our podcasts. I know. I enjoy them too, but it is worth t- taking us to a break for this mm-hmm. one. Uh, we don't necessarily have confirmation as to why, but it does look like we're going to be taking uh, a little bit of a break. So seven rounds into this one. We'll take one and we'll be back to get this game carried on. It's just the first map and only seven rounds in. So be be.
patience during those tech issues and we're back i promised we would be it is time for round seven myself pansy and spoonge hanging out here ready to bring you the action spoonge i want to start actually by setting the scene for the full buy we have seen team spirit a little anti strat and a little shaken wouldn't you say spoonge yeah it's been difficult for them i prefer spud j but uh, ah, look, we can work on it in the future uh, they've saved two weapons. This is the AK in the hands of Magix and I dispense with the AWP, and they've bolstered that with three Galils. And we were talking about how that update was in November last year, Ugh. the price dropping <laughs> to make it viable. So thank you for uh, watching, guys. I do feel like there's a couple of tricks up the call sleeve. This is contact, and Rush was ready for it. His off angle found. Now Oboe, very exposed. Has to be precise on the first headshot, and it will be Magix, no slouch. Oh god, so many targets. He's gonna surely get overwhelmed. He does well to find one. Rotate's coming in. Surely that bomb's gonna be going down. Yeah, the smokes are out. Nade two. Doesn't quite find Mir. Very low HP. And now Config wants to play around his own smoke. Oh, you cheeky little monkey. Look at that. I love watching Config. He's one of those players that's always gonna be exciting. I oh, and does get found eventually, but it wasn't pretty. And now the 3v3 retake if they want it. Well, it doesn't look like they do. <laughs> no, it was so funny. As you said, the 3v3 retake, we cut to blame and T-spawn. <laughs> it's, it's as if they want it, but... Uh... It's not looking likely. No. So this is the percentage counter-strike. This is... Uh... Go on, Chad. Getting Go on, just do it. You haven't done it in a while. Making sure that you're holding on to the weapons. The economy is a very, very fragile thing on the CT side in counter-strike and blame. Well, he's going to... See what he can find. No one's coming looking. No one's coming fishing. So everyone happy to have a bit of a stalemate in this one. And the reason that you see them saving these guns is so they can get a buy working in this round right here, round number eight. Poison will be able to drop across a gun. Config will be able to drop one as well. And with this, otherwise, they would not have been able to be competitive in this round. There would have been, you know, upgrades of some pistols, some deagles, maybe some SMGs. Nothing as juicy as... Three M4A4s, an AK-47, the AWP, and well, what is almost a full set of utility. This is about as good as a full buy gets in 2020. Back towards B, they chug. Mir dropping the Molotov over towards the sandbag position. And there's always a smoke going on towards the bathrooms. Actually, where did SDY smoke go? Oof, that's a lot of nade damage. Where was that from? Just thrown in. On the walk up. Oh, Rush, you're about to get overwhelmed here. Magic's already takes down the first. The pre fly oh. was great from Rush. Oh, look at him go. A quick triple disbalance thrown off. And now with the AWP, desperately trying to find a way back in, but it's a four versus two courtesy of Rush. Rush has been the immovable object. His work before coming in on that pistol, sitting on short with the Deagle. He has been the brick wall of B. Immovable. 
team spirit. I just balance and chopper doubled up, trying to make something happen for themselves. The double stack towards Monster. It looks like Config shifted himself over to support Rush. You've got Blame F, though, as well, creating this lovely crossfire and leaving Poison to roam as he pleases. I mean, there's a universe where they both die to his spray. Here we go. Not today. Now that must just balance into a near impossible scenario. Up in the off angle, does pluck Rush off and swinging in. Needed that one cleanly. Could have been the 1v1. Really valiant attempt from Disbalance. Double kill in the round, but it will translate to complexity six. And they admittedly have been kept relatively honest. I just saw that they're all forced back to like $150 pocket change, Chad. So I know it's, I know it looks like complexity is smashing it, but is this when you normally say, Alex, calm down. They just need one to break them. Precisely. I'm with you. So uh, Team Spirit, they can keep the pressure on here if they would like. The loss bonus is starting to trickle up nicely for them to go for those half buys. Or a buy with some Galils and Mac 10s. This could just be all in fast B. Coming in, they're smoking off towards connector. Rush B. <laughs> Let's see if they stop. Config's the one who's going to be greeting them at the door. That's going to be one, but instantly overwhelmed. Yeah, and now Rush is really in a tight spot. Magix does get him. Ovo's keeping it fair. Smoke for the retake onto that bridge. Oh, he's dropped down. He won't be able to do too much with that. That is uh, actually going to have a disbalance. He can play just on the precipice of it. And I know they've been playing the percentages, Chad, but this is a tough conversation to go for it. A couple of flashes and smokes. Let's see if they can find anybody hanging around or peeking when they shouldn't. Looks like they're going for it. Gearing forward. Flashes go out over with the peek. Here we are. Finds one. Disbalance has to find this, and that might be enough of a deterrent. Blames Flash. Forces him to look down, but they don't gather ground. Now all onto him. Disbalance for the transfer. Blame saves the day. Kit present. And it will be another complexity round by the skin of their teeth. The best of a while from Team Spirit. They're still there. They're still right yep. there. And it's that the plan, same old story. That plan allows them to buy again and have even more of a potent buy. It won't be MAC-10s and Galils. It'll be AKs and AWPs if that's what they want to bring on out. They, you know, we, we know you can keep the MAC-10s if you want to go for faster plays, if you want to continue that rushy style. And they were very close, right? Think about how close they were to converting that. That is a spree of rounds if they are able to win just one of these. So money, still very, very tight between both squads. This might be one where we bring out the econ graph in the uh, post game just to show everybody what I'm talking about. I do like the graph. Doesn't see enough light. I think it's a banging idea, Chadney. So notice this smoke behind Magix's position over towards the squeaky door. They're throwing this so that they can't get pincered. Nice camera angle there. Rushly as poison picks up Ida's balance. Imagine if they were ready for this again. Looks like Obo is. is. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so this could be a case of Spirit not having a plan C. They've had A, we've, they've had B. It doesn't seem like there's Ooh. any more depth or any more alternatives. We've seen Disbalance taking space long in like the first round of play. What map's that line where they have a C bomb site? Split? That splits the one with the ladder with is, the ropes. Is, is basically nuke. What's the other one? Haven? Hey, Haven, that's Haven. it. With, with that, it that's... I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. I, the maps are really not intuitive by name. No, the, the Ning Ming has really not. not. I, no. I didn't mean to put you on the spot there, Lauren. I'm you've, sorry. You've done me in, sorry. Chad. We've got Overpass, because there's an Overpass. There's an o train. Nuke, the it's trains. a nuke. Train is a dust, train. Very dust, dusty. very dusty. Valve don't do anything with the game. No, they just don't support us. Everything's going to be horrible. Oh. Lame's about to take down Chopper. Watch this. <laughs> Should be good. <laughs> Oh, Blame, I, and this is the thing with Blame, it's it's the work he does outside of the server that's so impressive as well. The preparation clearly that they have coming into this, but then he can keep up in game. We've seen uh, a couple of different IGL styles coming through that both have proven to work very well, which is lovely to see some die young refusing for now, but 10 seconds, it's, it's more a matter of when than if. And not going down after the time, like I prefaced earlier. He's actually going forward again. He's still in the open. They could flank him from long here. This is going to come down to the top. Go on, here he goes. Let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, he got the kill as well. <laughs> SDY playing with fire. Okay, so timeout will be called second one for Team Spirit here. And now their money's in that middle of the road. So the 3,400 is the max loss bonus that you'll be getting. You can see the residual cash they have added on there. And that means that right now they could buy. We can mention the Galils again. We can mention the Mac 10s again. SDY with the AK-47. They have enough to go up and, and have a crack again. Uh, they're doing damage, taking down 
The last few members of Complexity there in the tail end. That's a very stressful duel that he's having at that final stretch. That one right there is the one that would get me the most. Ooh. You don't like it. No, I don't like it. You don't like it. Just because I would already be dead because I was an in-game leader <laughs> and I'd be watching it. You're but... not the blame F, IGL. No, 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 no. Not definitely that. not. You're not the 10 to 5 looking real good. ADR's second in the team. But still, look at the cash right now. The buy on the side of okay. things for Complexity is, is uh, it, it, we would normally say this is a bad buy, but it's because they're getting forced into this scenario time and time again. We, we, we discussed the money thing, but 8 to 2 is still a scoreline, right? It's like, That's true. by whatever means, they're still doing it. But it is, you know, that breaking point eventually moves further away, I think, from viability at these sort of scorelines. But as said, for Spirit, they, it, it does tell you the story of how close this game has been. It, does, it certainly does. I mean, there have been so many multiple two-on-twos, one-on-ones, three-on-ones. Mm -hmm. Rush, he's got an idea. I wonder if Obo's considering a little maneuver with him. Oh. I almost felt like one-way traffic over towards this B side of things for the majority of the starts for Team Spirit. Oh my god, the timing poison. You have to be very careful, my friend. Oh, if he gets shot in the back of the head. Oh, that was a real chance for a complete change of the guard. Instead, game on. Complexity spot one lurk. They do push. That was a real chance to make things awkward. Nice control <laughs> of his spray from Oboe as well. Really nice to see. And the bomb's loose. What are they left with? Still with the AK, I guess, on some die young. That's something, but beyond that, very little Look at their here. setup. I wouldn't want to break B at all. Like, you really don't have many ways in. Poison does take down the hardest hitter. And he's not quite going to finish there. So Chopper last spotted firing bullets at Poison, who's now fragging over at the other side of the map. Blame contains him. I got a nice little tip. Yo, Chad, tell me how this feels for you, because I don't know what your opinion is on it. Sure. Carrigan did a little, pr like a pro tip, if you will. Rush might like this too. Oh, nice. The three, two, one. Hey, future pros. Uh, tip of the day, if you find yourself in a clutch scenario and need to peek when enemies are coming, then counting down from three mm -hmm. will help you stay focused and not second guess if it's the right timing or not. A bit of a nuanced tip, but lots of people are interacting with that. He's just suggesting, you know, when you're in that position where you hear the steps coming, like Blame just then, he hear the steps, he just counts to three in his head before swinging out for that fight. Okay, so just making sure Instead he's of kind of exactly on what he's about to do. Some people don't half commit to a fight or they over jiggle, you know what I'm saying? Sure. Carrigan suggests a quick intention, internal right. count with intention. Okay, not something I've ever considered. It no, nor I. Anyway. That's, a, that's a curious one. Ooh. Oh, I thought, oh, I oh, think he pushing. might have seen oh, them. Did they Look see how it? Much room they've got. Oh. Uh -oh, I guess I got uh -oh, the information uh -oh, uh -oh. rush. Just about makes it away. God, I, I don't think you expect that. Uh, preparation or not, maybe have seen it before, but clearly being a little caught out on their push up through Monster. But for now, the CT is going to have to operate with four, but bear in mind, Rush is super low. He does have his util still, so he can buy time. But you can see the adjustment from complexity. I think, is it just Rush here for now? This is a massive gamble. With a, with a call like this, Rush has a lot of responsibility on his shoulders to make sure that if it is a B attack, that he can either survive or slow them down. And they're doing a full gamble over towards A. So they're hoping that the smoke that they've just deployed is enough to make sure it isn't a B piece. But with 50 seconds left and no territory over towards the toilets or connector, it has to be the B finisher in spirit. Blame's going to lob out another smoke. They're going to see that's coming from A. They might actually just call the bluff on this and start walking through. If it holds them at bay, this could be massive for a complexity because they can push forward through a fake. And yeah, so they're going through the sandbag area now. Smoke over towards the site. It is the B finish. It is. And I don't know if there's anything that they're going to do to can dispute that. Poison not going to have the angle for the plant. Does get chopper. Bomb going down now, courtesy of magics. Another smoke pulled out. None remain as the final bit of utility is drained. But as you can see, this is just more to suppress and contain. They're happily playing the percentages for the maximum amount of rounds they can post. And of course, as you saw before, CTs with the loss bonus of 1,400. That is quite a nasty little number. Did Rush do the monster smoke from site? Blame kind did, of. Yeah. Blame did, Was it yeah. Blame? Yeah. So look, we were having setups yeah. once upon it. That's where Rush did his from, yep. So And it looks exactly... Blame exact did his from. Can you tell the difference between uh, the two? If you're looking in the general direction, one's going to come from a higher trajectory yeah. than the other. And it's going to uh, be sailing through the map for a little bit longer. But you would need to be looking in that. Yeah. You need to be right place, right time. So it fulfills. It, it kind of does the job. It, I doubt many people would probably be looking in that direction. That's, that's quite cool. I hadn't seen that before. There's a, the, the thing with this map is just how you can sail smokes almost across. Like there's, mm. there's a smoke that I saw 
I was actually talking to um, Casey Foster from, from Refrag, and he showed me that there's this smoke that he worked out using his tool, that if you're, you know the stairs near the connector, uh, at the top there's like a little bench, throwing a smoke from that bench right there to get heaven on the B side. It was I, wild. Yeah, there's some misdirections. Smokes. Look at the pace though, hold on, they've gone back to what Kinda work, Rush B, don't stop. Obo down, Rush now called upon. He's been delivering. Config wants him, but here's Rush still oh, waiting. He had a real chance, a lovely gap. Didn't quite convert onto SDY. They are low. At least down to 56, 44, no nades and incendiary though. Oh, and Poison's locked the door behind them. If Magix was to moonwalk, he would be vulnerable. Not gonna make that amateur mistake. Chopper's contained Poison's uh, retreat. The incendiary not quite going to be used to stop that plant. So again, complexity faced with a all too familiar task of save or an unfavorable retake. Loss bonus of 1900 as well. You can do the maths yourself. Yeah, not interested. Yeah. So B, I mean, Chad, it's Team Spirit's approach to the game, for lack of a better word, does just feel like very blunt trauma. Yeah, it's like, one dimensional, it's right? Just, we are going to keep charging in and if the human being with the mouse in his hand clicks first, we might win a round or two. And, and this is where you might see it change because as the leading style of going B, going B, making sure that you crack that egg, which they've now done, right? They've now been able to break that streak, make them have to consider, well, careful, Poison, careful. Oh, yo, yo. Do, they, do they want to now, with this situation in play, go for more of an A direct attack? Because what we might see happen is a four-man B lean for complexity. So this is the mind games. You're trying to force the other team to make a decision or against what you're doing. So the guns will be dropped and it will be a buy round. Complexity might do exactly that. Poison looks like he's postured to go over towards B as well. So if it will be the rush based off the spawn that Poison has here, we might want to stick with him. He might go for either a short or a B long push and get early info. But there is a massive gap towards A. So you can see here they're going for the totem stack again. Seeing if they're going to peek anybody up towards heaven. This time they might get lucky. Here we go. Come on. Oh, it's perfect. He gets it. Bye-bye, Rush. I think Config spotted it a little too late, but he did spot it. Oh, look at this, though. There's bathing him into a trap, so the death might not be the worst thing in the world. Wait, is he peeking this? Oh, Poison still finds Mir. That's beautiful play from him. On the surf. That is not an easy tracking shot to keep up with. So really nice stuff from Poison. Very, very much... Uh... Up and coming, I slash top tier Orpa. I mean, I really think he can keep it and hang with the very best. Good to see him putting in a home where he can develop that talent. Oh, it's a gamble stack primarily over towards B. Blame isn't spotting for A. This is sound cues are going to come through and he's going to need to call for one of his teammates to rotate. So he's going to get cleared out. Oh, I like the off angle. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. You wouldn't call it clear, but he does get one. Now never, you'll never guess which site they're going to hit, Lauren. Oh, well, they could have gone, eh? That's right? the smoke Chad gets all wet about. Check this one out. It just throws it, separates the site, corrals them Very on the right side too. of the pillar. It's not, it's not a hard smoke for once. I, I hate the, you know, run, look at this tiny pixel, put your glove here, but Config just puts a crosshair on Chopper. Nice and easy. Sometimes Young and I disbalance kind of locked out here. It feels as though the game's been read a touch. They, they some individual brilliance and Sunday Young might be up for it. Ooh, damn. 14 seconds. SDY needs to get that bomb down. Poison as well. Oh, he's playing around the smoke and finds the angle. SDY. According to Magix, the uh, the comedian of the group throws his AK away and doesn't get to pick up anything. So it's a little fun. And keep it. Not That's the gags. Him. That's what he does. He's like, ha guys, we won the round. I don't need this. <laughs> Oof. Oof. It's a very, very difficult shot for a rifle to hit from that range. Everybody knows, sir. Let's see that clutch again from SDY. Oh, damn. One, shadow advantage, two, and here's number three. It's very nice play around the smoke. Poison, of course, left wondering where he's supposed to be peeking. Why is he pushing me? Why? 12 seconds, he exploits it. This could be a 9-6 half, and where this started, great stuff from Yeah, Team phenomenal. And, and I mean, Blame's been doing his very best in terms of trying to put all, as many players in the right site as possible. You can understand these gamble stacks be, but Spirit, War of Attrition being one. Yeah, the blunt object seems to have got it done until now. It should redirect, it should revert to the correct course. Obo gonna push forward, does find some die young, but two still stand, Poison and Blame F. And Blame F's in the right place. This one down chopper, Poison trying to assist. Not gonna happen, is now just Blame He's kind of threaded the needle. 
The needle threads back. That doesn't make sense. But what does make sense is the scoreline. Spirit finally broke complexity. It took a little bit you of time, the but they made it you had work. No time to even Would you give up your rights and let your life slide away? Couple of gamble sacks not paying off, and the brute force of Team Spirit breaking down the door at B. We do have the competitive game, it seems, for the first of our seventh day. My God, are yourself Pro League never stops, and neither will complexity. Now on the T side, Sponge and Pansy hanging out in the studio live from Cologne. Let's get used to hashtag ESL Pro League to let us know how you're watching. And let's get into our 16th round of play. Plenty of util for Russian Obo, two unarmored gamers, but a P250 going to enable some longer fights like this one towards party disbalance trying to contain. Nothing exciting to write home about just yet, but walking through that connector area to get this towards a pivot. You can go A or B. Seems like it will be the former. Yeah, that nade and P250 is making a priority of pushing back the early CT aggression. They've done exactly that. Take a look at the minimap. So far back now, a team spirit on the site. His eye disbalance, he was the first man to be greeted with damage and he'll be the first to find more as Obo shooting down range from long, keeping them on notice. And the flashes are going to come over any second from Rush. It's an A hit. It is. The smoke's already going to be blooming. Obo's trying to close that gap as it plumes. And yeah, so it will chopper isolated. No armor on him as well. So he's going to retreat and play this for the retake. Access given and granted. Bam bomb going down. Mir on the flank. And Blame's already spotted him. So Rush should connect that shot and he does. Now getting awkward for the CTs. 
Very, very oh, awkward. And config makes it look so easy. Um, and now just magics. 1v5. It's uh, a little rough. He hit that. Hit one. He yeah. hit that one. Yeah, that was a hard one as well. So yeah. not going to be too exciting for him, but double digits for Colin. There's Blaine once again getting the uh, football chance going. <laughs> Have we seen... Uh, Oh, Jason Lake in the in the fan cams yet? I haven't Not seen the fan cams time. yet today, have we? Oh. Pretty bit early for him, isn't it? It is very oh, early. I said that last time, and I think he was there. I keep uh, I keep uh, riding him off. I don't know which part of this. I guess he probably lives in in Texas. One would assume, which is where the Dallas Cowboys are. Yeah, which are the owners of Complexity. Yes. I feel like I've just done some uh, great deduction right there. <laughs> Detective Channel the case these needs. Seventy damage on an unarmored opponent. That is. A high number. There you go, Alex. It's the Alex uh, analysis for you. Big old stack, isn't it? Three players having a little run around. We've got deagles out. We've got full armor, to be fair. Obviously, excluding I disbalance on the scout, but not been really given much time to do anything with it. No, and it feels like with them being whittled down so much already, three of them are the walking wounded, that uh, they're going to have a very, very tough time of being able to convert this one whatsoever. You can see here, regrouping now a complexity, and this is the way you want to go about these type of rounds. Regroup, trade out efficiently, use your utility, know the corners you need to clear. Simple counter-strike, but the most effective kind. I mean, the amount of times we've seen teams really struggling against eco up sides or, you know, force spot upsides potentially, I guess, is, is the better way to put it. But for now, things going okay for the Ts. They've, they've managed to weather the initial foray, but they are down to 30 seconds, so problems can occur in those, you know, the wee hours as Magic's going to get oh. one. That's nice. Couldn't make much more of it. I just balance currently smoked out. Got a little bit of a line up there, but... But now the T is just going through the motions, it feels. They they haven't got too much to worry about. Rush and Oboe playing nice and forward so they can catch anyone who would dare. But at this point, there's not really much to be done. Yeah, this might just be hold on, have a crack in the following round. We spoke about it the other day with some saved weapons. If you're able to get yourself anything else, well, there's not any primaries really available on the ground for them right here. So take what I was about to say, throw it out the window, and just know that they're going to hold on to these deagles and the scout for di uh, disbalance and try again in the following round, which will be round number 18. Complexity will be jumping up to 11 on the board here. Looking good. They've just traded out Rush onto the Galil from the MAC-10 that was on the ground, so they're getting the best weapons they possibly can. You can see here they're saving towards backyard. You want to be outside of the radius of the bomb. It's about to detonate. Kablammo is the noise it makes. Kablam. And we'll have that similar scenario yet again. Now, because Spirit will be buying in the following, what we might see happen on a round like this is them go a little bit more aggressive with these save pistols, take a few more fights, take a few more risks, because they don't need to carry this through. There's the fan cams. Hiya. Hello, everybody. So I'm curious to see on the CT side where they want to take this direction. Magix has a B spawn, but he doesn't actually have any upgraded pistols. Chopper's throwing a smoke over towards that monster tunnel. Trying to hold him at bay for a little bit early. And back over, we have... Uh, I just bounce towards Long with the scout. He would be my danger man for the round, but at the moment, they're not headed in his direction. Whoa, top up. Oh, load of damage, and Flame F just <sighs> muscling into the site there. Not, not too much finesse to it, but it does certainly get the job done. And once again, the CT's uh, not able to do much here, Alex. No, certainly not. Just going to be uh, tagged up, soon to be body bagged up. Bombs loose, they're not in any rush, so it's just going to come down to how much damage can you do. Magic's absolutely capable, but we're down to 50 already. He's lost his teammates, and Blame and Rush working in perfect unison to open up this site. Looks like the 12th is nothing more than a formality. We'll watch the time tick away. Disbalance and SDY are going to be clutching onto what little they have. Of course, a Scout and a Deagle, respectively, and so they will continue to patrol, hoping to catch any stragglers lingering towards T-Spawn, but this one is done. Would you consider yourself a straggler, Alex? I don't think I'm a straggler necessarily. I think I'm more of a leader. Okay. Uh, just not in the typical sense, you know, in terms of authority or a loud voice or patronizing. You don't do the yelling. No, because I've always had huge issues with authority. Okay. Like, I, you know, like my PE teacher, I, I, from a young age, I, it was very obvious to me that he was like undereducated and incapable of controlling even young ch children. Children, yep. And so I kind of communicated that to him passive aggressively and made me very unpopular with many of my teachers. 
Um, but when I respect someone and I value their opinion, I'm very quick to uh, follow their lead. Oh, thanks. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> There's been no gold stars handed out, Lauren. You'd be happy with that. Rush didn't even want the, the drive home yesterday. Yeah, I actually no, really, I didn't like that. I, I, I don't like, like that. He's doing stuff. Why didn't he directly communicate with us? Uh, the group. With us. Yeah. yeah. And, and then, then he goes off and plays games without us too. Well, like, like, we're here trying to build up this kind of, you know, nice. It concerns me. I think maybe Rush, I there? actually hate him. Oh, now he's ignoring us. Okay, yeah, I mean, so fine. there's a silent uh, treatment. Some, all right, we'll focus on the wrong. game. We'll focus on the game. It's the first gun round here in the second half. I dispense with the AWP going now. down towards connector. Can he find a pick onto Obo? Yes, no. Maybe I don't know. <laughs> Can you repeat the question? Right, let's have a look. I like this. They, they've got some... Like, look at this room they're getting up here. Now, last time around, we saw this kind of on the flip side. How much room was garnered when they went on this run? I think it was someday Young, potentially. I'm not too sure. Straight up. But these guys have no one to stop them. So they've kind of circumnavigated looking, the two They're players. They're not even looking. And look at this, ridiculous. Alex. It's going to be perfect. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. He, he can't be calling it clear. Oh, he's going to catch the rotate. Chopper's going to be so confused. Uh -oh. oh, my God. Uh-oh. Alarm bell's ringing. Awkward. This gets awkward. Disbalance now. Roll reversed. Oh, my God. There's another one. Where did he come from? Sneaking down long with blame, and he's opted to just tuck into the bank position. Oboe catches them on one side. This is a peculiar round. Poor old team spirit. Rocking a hard place. Oboe is the aforementioned hard place, and here comes the rock now from long. Oh. Can you smell? Oh. Oh, it's horrible. horrible. He's what unkillable. He's unhittable. Chopper's movement is clearly just uh, 4D chess. No one can hit, but collect, connect a bullet onto him. Finally, he does go down. Magix and Mir going to be faced with the uh, familiar circumstances of complexity's first half, which is save or have poopy weapons for the next. Yeah, and that right there, I can't explain anything other than the fact of complexity doing their homework and abusing the rotations. There's a timer on playing the bathrooms in that regard. You eventually have to drop back and deal with it or have a rotator, which would have been Chopper coming over just to make sure that nobody's crept on through. But I think at the pace that Lauren was pointing out and how quick complexity were to take that, they knew that that was an option. They knew that that was an avenue and they punished it immediately. So Team Spirit with their overpass pick, well, they're getting beaten quite handedly here after what was a close first half. We were talking about through all the money situations and scenarios for them to even be able to post six rounds on the board. This can run away from them very quickly here on the CT side. Two four spies that really netted them nothing. A gun round that was taken away from them before it even started. Mm. And now they found themselves in a position with two saved rifles where they almost have to go for a buy behind it. So I think the game is going to trickle away from them very quickly here. Ouch. the complexity signs. Still no word from Rush, but we are still in a gun round, so we'll have to check back in when we get a sec. Maybe we'll have to, like, give him a hug or something and sort it out. Ooh. No one there, but love the idea. I love anything like that. We've seen a couple of, you know, bits and pieces from both sides, you know, quite tailored to the opposition. Clearly, complexity doing a little bit more homework than spirit in this regard with config who is in that beautiful position waiting for the boost on the other side. Now, Sam Young slowly but surely having to peel away from this, but utility is being spent towards clearing. And Spirit can fall back. Don't have that AWP anymore to depend upon. Precisely. Stack nades. One of the many prongs of this attack. Interesting boost going on there. What do they see from Poison's POV? Ah, he just wants to peek over the right side. That's nice. Still 45 seconds left on the clock. Only a very light bit of utility left from Team Spirit. And they don't really have anything to fight the range of Poison. So once they get zoned down by Poison's orb, they will have to turtle up on that site. Now the rotation, or the potential danger man, in-game leader Chopper, he's the one in swing right now. We have Mir committed, we have Magic very committed, and now that Poison has spotted that, he's been spotted himself. I just bounce knows not to repeat, and 20 seconds left. He's trying to pay oh, him in. it's a great molly. Yeah, I don't know if that's going to be enough. False sense of security, surely oh, not. What? Oh, Poison was tenure. ready. He's checking his corners. Disbalance, trying to find a way out. Chopper certainly hasn't. Over the smoke, a chance of elevation maybe to contest, but it's not going to stop the plan. He's going to have to reload. Oh, oh damn. Mir does connect through the smoke in the end with a silent. Done with the final bullet. Takes off Oboe's head, but 
It is Complexity's 14th. And yeah, as, as predicted, Chad, it does seem like they've kind of um, been unable to post a single CT round, and I don't see any kind of positive signs heading into this one. Yeah, run out of gas, I think, right here. And well, Nuke coming up next. That'll be map number two. Things don't get better for them, considering how good we've seen Complexity look on this. Might be set up for a bit of a 2-0 for the day. I don't want to get... Too ahead of yourself. Yeah, you know, the I want forest in the stick. trees that's thing the, situation. That's the thing. I'm back. I'm back looking at the forest. Yeah, I'm, come on, Chad. We're I'm, in orbit. <laughs> I'm in orbit right now. We're talking about but the, the individual bark of the trees. We're talking about the leaf. Ooh, tip of the head. Oh. And I can't believe he sats and takes it. Disbalance, slow to react, puts the open mirrors hands for this one. Five versus four. Could this be the 15th? Well. Yeah. It, yeah. It's a bit, it feels like a bit of a non-start, which is a bit unfortunate. And, and honestly, I want to look at this. I'm going to skew my opinion into the fact that Complexity, honestly, were very well prepared, and I, I love that element about them. But it's a shame we haven't seen the better side of Spirit here, maybe because it has been quelled by people like Blame F, putting in the hard work. But we are seeing a bit of a fight back. We still have Chopper posted up on shore, still trying to do some damage, but Poison in towards Sai. Nice work from mere instantaneous trade. It's not without an answer in some die young. I'm not a believer, Chad. He's got he's got the same gun as you have. A little bit different stickers, I Conflict's believe. low, though, Lawrence, and maybe you should believe a little bit do, right now. Do, There's a chance. There's a window. Do we, Chad? And it's been closed, slammed <laughs> shut. His fingers were in it. And oh. uh, it's Ooh. unfortunate because complexity are up to 15 everywhere. right now. That is a 15 to 6 scoreline for those of you listening on the radio. I know there's plenty of you out there. Driving your car to work, having to listen to the Counter-Strike. This complexity are running away with this one. One more round necessary, and the money situation over there for the side of things of spirit, it's uh, as good as it can be because max loss bonus is a thing, but that's not a great place to be on the CT side. You can see Mag7, Famuses, Galore, Light, Utility, and the Juggernaut. Oh, it's running through walls, it's breaking spirits. <laughs> <laughs> I like that, Chad. All right. Let's see if we can close this out nice and strong for Complexity. This has been a great showing for them. Mir trying to even things out, though, pushing up, getting a bit of room, a bit of attentive play from the CT side, getting a little involved here. But I want to see what the answer is. Once maybe Spirit pushes a little harder towards Complexity. If there is an answer, bear in mind, it's for now Poison, and the Whoa. boys do start working forward. Does he look down here? Oh, he might do now, but that's a terrible look to be having. As poison will fall, the orb goes around and oh, the nades. Was that? Who just placed that nade towards it? Yeah, from the underpass, might have been Obo. Mm. Config's taking space again. It's a very, very similar gap to before. See how procedural he's being with it. Chopper's playing aggressive in the toilets. Config's intentions here are to fight towards Mir. The nade looks good too. Quite, just a little over the top. But look at this amount of space he's on the A side. Going They're B. going B. There's three CTs forced to address config. Finally goes down. Mission accomplished, though. Fired some shots. Job done. Bomb down. This will not necessarily translate to a round, though. Poor old Mir has been caught out by blame. He hasn't gone down. Down to 12, but he'll be locked out by a very deep smoke. Heaven becomes an option. That'll be with the responsibility of Obo. They want to play close by graffiti. Did they plant for themselves? I'm not sure. Yeah, this makes more sense. Obo needs at least one here to set up blame. That's good. Shot. And now it falls to blame. Let's see what he's got. Been spotted before. Chopper's done the dance, but it's some die young to keep spirit in this. But it is, it's, it's, it's not looking brilliant overall, even with the round win. They're going to need so much more to be able to get over this. And the money's outstanding for complexity. Looking towards almost cap for poison. We're, we, we're, we're fine on the uh, complexity side, of course. Maybe you could go for something a little bit faster if you're complexity. There's no rush, actually. Normally in this state, because of how not cruise control of the game has felt, but because it feels like they're in command of the game, they don't necessarily need to rush things. I was saying that they, the idea of a, a pace change might catch Spirit off guard, but now that they've been able to skip, uh, pick up some of those weapons, the loss bonus, uh, sorry, the win bonus, making sure that they can have a proper buy going forward, they're in this, the most potent place they've been in the entire half. Looks like they're set up for a B hit right now, so Magic's in mid to deliver. This is where the comeback conversation could start. If they lock this out cleanly... Yeah, it's an if, though. Flash looks good. Magic's gonna gobble it up. No, he's not. But Config catching him in the quick. And now, oh, goodness. This one gets difficult. Chopper needs a multi. Finds the head of Rush, but can't pull the trigger. 
Double kill coming in from the American to set them up for success. It does feel like a 16. They're three frags already deep. And poor SDY and Disbalance. They have some util and some trivial damage done. Config falling, step one. Obo caught by Disbalance. Oh, would have been step two, but he switches away. <laughs> oh, that's a perfect finish. Blame through.